So real estate and mortgage brokerages make millions a year by helping clients and customers buy and sell real estate and obtain mortgage financing. In this video, I'm gonna show you how you can earn a passive income just like them without having to open up a brokerage, hire agents, or build a team. You can literally make five or six figures a year with little to no experience. And in today's video, I'm gonna show you how. Mr. Wolf Hansen here, and thank you for stopping by my channel and for watching this video. Just to remind you, I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice, and any content presented on my channel is to provide you with information and also share my journey. So before taking action on any of the content I present, just make sure you do your own due diligence and speak to your appropriate counsel. Now, for those of you who don't understand how this proven and traditional, highly profitable business model works, let me give you an idea of the earning potential. So to start, real estate and mortgage agents have to work for a brokerage when they get licensed. Every deal that they do, their brokerage will actually take a cut from the gross commission that they earn. This is known as a brokerage split. Different brokerages offer different splits and depending on the brokerage's business model, it actually does vary. For example, some brokerages offer a 70-30 split, where 70% goes to the agent and 30% goes to the brokerage. Other brokerages offer a 80-20 split, where 80% goes to the agent and 20% goes to the brokerage. Now, for the sake of this example, we will be using a 90-10 split. This is actually the split that I had with my old brokerage once I hit and maintained a certain level of production and income. Here's the exciting part. Realtors earn a percentage of the sales price while mortgage agents earn a percentage of the loan amount that they get for their clients. In some cases, it can be a fixed dollar amount as well. And just to be clear, the compensation a client pays to their broker will vary. It's negotiable and it's also between the client and their brokerage. Nevertheless, for the sake of this video, I will use 2.5% because it's actually the average commission earned in my local real estate market when we are representing buyer clients. So let's do a case study. Say for example, we are helping a buyer buy their first home. We will actually be assisting them with buying both the real estate and getting the mortgage for them. In my local market here in the greater Toronto area, as of today, the average home price is over $1 million. But to be conservative for this example, let's just say the buyer client is buying the home for 800,000 then the income earned will be as follows. As the realtor representing the buyer, I would earn 2.5% of 800,000, which will equal to $20,000. With my split of 90-10, I will earn $18,000 while my brokerage earns $2,000. As a loan officer on the file, this is what I would earn. Assuming the client puts down 20% and my brokerage fee is 1% on the file, then the mortgage we will be getting for the client would actually be $640,000. So the gross commission that would be earned on the file would then be $6,400. If we now take our brokerage split into consideration, and let's say in this example, it's an 80-20 split, then I would earn $5,120 and my brokerage will earn $1,280 on the file. In this example, my total gross commission, including real estate and mortgage earnings, would be $23,120 for successfully helping out one client. Now, this is just an example, and of course, every deal is different, but I wanted to give you a clear demonstration of how lucrative this business model is. Of course, the more clients you serve and the more you transact, the more money you will make. But to be honest, it's highly competitive. And to win in this game, you have to have solid systems in place that enable you to provide your clients with a great experience. So how do brokerages make money? Well, it's simple. <laughs> it's just one word, leverage. Okay, so let's just say we own a brokerage and we have 1,000 agents. The average home sold per agent, let's say is 10, because some agents are gonna sell more, some are gonna sell less, some are not gonna sell anything at all. So let's just average it out to 10. So the number of homes therefore sold for the brokerage for the year would be let's say 10,000 homes including buyer and seller deals. If the average sale price is say $800,000 in this example and the average commission is what we had stated before and let's just say the brokerage was earning 2,000 on average per deal that means our gross earning as a brokerage in its entirety would be 20 million dollars. Yep that's right. 20 big kahunas. Pretty lucrative, huh? 
Now let's take it to the mortgage brokering side of things. What if we got 20% of our mortgage commission revenue? What would that look like? So let's say we have 100 agents with an average of 25 files closed per agent and an average commission of 6,400 per file, let's say 1%. That means we have a total of 2,500 closed mortgage files for the year. Now, when we take the commission into consideration, that's $16 million in commission revenue collected. We as a brokerage will receive 20% of that amount, which will total $3.2 million in gross earning. Now that's impressive. Okay, so, why do I bring all this up? Now, what if I told you I have created a way to help you get a piece of that action? A way where we can leverage the efforts of others with a team effort and get a percentage of the revenue on an ongoing basis. Now that's what our WMG partnership program is all about. In a nutshell, I own a marketing agency and this is what we do. We help businesses obtain more customers and increase their sales revenue. We then get compensated through a percentage of the revenue that's generated. Our partnership program allows us to partner with investors such as yourself who provide the marketing dollars for us to invest in proven client acquisition systems and help local real estate and mortgage brokerages basically obtain new customers and clients and scale marketing systems. We then get paid a percentage of the commission that is earned. Once we are paid that commission, we then split that amount with our partners, which would be you. And here is the best part. Unlike these other opportunities here in the crypto space where you don't know who's operating the project, don't know their experience, and you don't know their level of expertise, with our project, you will know exactly who's involved, their license and registration details, business and contact information and we don't hide behind technology. There actually will be full transparency and the opportunity to have access to management and support staff. Now regarding regulation and compliance, well, there's nothing to worry about there because all the agents and brokerages and entities that are involved all have the proper licensing to practice and service clients. I've also structured the partnership in a way where you are legally entitled to earn revenue from the proceeds of commission earned. Furthermore, you don't have to be licensed, nor will you have to participate in any real estate activity, but you will still enjoy the benefit of earning an income. Why? Because of that one word, leverage. So if you want to learn more on how it works and how we can help you earn, let's say 30 to 148% per quarter, or let's say 120 to 592% a year, or even more, then click on the link in the description below, guys. Either watch the 30 minute presentation that I have done for you or download our white paper for additional information. Now, let me give you a quick overview of the partnership program to see if it even makes sense for you. So our marketing agency currently has a lender client that wants 1000 customers for their new loan product within the next, let's say 12 months. During the last four months, we've created a successful marketing campaign for that product and that product is actually producing some really good results. Based on those results, to help this lender achieve their goal, we will need approximately $400,000 in ad spend to help them acquire 1,000 new customers for that specific product. As a result, this will gross us anywhere from 2.5 to $3 million in commission sales revenue. So for this specific project, our goal is to raise $100,000 and reinvest the initial principal per quarter until we help them achieve their goal of 1,000 customers. The revenue our ad agency earns from this project will go towards making additional campaigns such as real estate and buyer-seller campaigns, refinance campaigns, mortgage campaigns. Whatever commission we earn from even those campaigns are also going to be added to the revenue pool, which means we will still pay you, even though it's not directly attached to the original campaign, we'll still pay for any campaign revenue that is generated. Now, unfortunately, there is a limit on the amount of money needed, so spaces are limited. There are a total of 100 shares. Each share is $1,000, giving us the $100,000 we need to start and manage the project. Our hope is that after this project, we will be able to create similar campaigns and expand operations. So this is only the beginning. The number of shares a partner holds will determine their share in the revenue pool. Now, there's quite a bit more information, but the purpose of this video isn't to go into the finer details, but rather to provide a brief overview. So if you would like to learn more again, go ahead and click the link below in the description area for a full presentation. In there, I will take my time to explain the process 
step by step how it works and the guidelines of the partnership program now guys this is a real business model real opportunity it's with real people it's a real plan it's a crypto project that is different from what people are used to in this space and i get it but maybe that's what we need real business ideas and plans that actually work for the short and long term after all real estate is my bread and butter i had personally put my real estate business on hold for a year so that i could build my online businesses and now that my online businesses are where they should be it's time to now go back into the real estate and mortgage sales business but this time i don't want to do it alone and i don't want to be in the field i literally do not want to be showing homes and putting signs on lawns but i do want to market to get the business and share the revenue amongst partners. I want to connect with a group of great individuals who understand the opportunity and can see the potential that this project can bring to us. There's always risk, there always is, but with proper plan, great minds, and a solid work ethic, success is more than possible. All right, that's it for this video, guys. If you want to learn more about the WMG Partnership Program, then click the link in the description area right now to learn more. If you found this video helpful, insightful, and you're not yet subscribed to my channel, what are you doing? Subscribe, come on, uh-uh. All right, go ahead, hit that notification bell, smash that like button, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thank you all for watching. Go ahead and check out that presentation right now. I look forward to working with you.